Um, they're, uh, they're really specific on how we do so, like from footwork to even um, our rhythm drops to our play action, everything has to be precise. And that's one thing that like is different for me and Brad. I mean, Coach Coley was a great guy, but uh, they're really focused on our feet. And they say uh, their biggest saying is that your feet make you right. And sometimes like we'll feel like we're holding the ball a little too long. And he's like, yeah, because your feet wasn't around this place. So, like they're helping us get our feet right, which is helping us in our game for like for like passing and run game and everything else. So it's 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 making our game go to another level. You asked how the responsibility split between coaches. Yeah, he asked me earlier. Is that, okay. Um, what about the bait not being in baseball? How much do you miss it? Oh, I miss it a lot. You know, I uh, try to keep a good relationship with a lot of the guys. I, I see them every often. Uh, when we have a big game, like I'll text them. Like I, I mess with Hayer, and I was like, hey, if I come out to the game, you got to hit me a home run. So like, I make jokes with them. You know, they they fully support me, and uh, I mean, from their side, I can see they're doing great, and I'm ec ecstatic for the way they've been playing lately. And Malik, she, she was actually asking something different. She was asking about how the coaches' responsibilities are different, like how John versus Mark, how they work with you guys. What she was. <coughs> oh, um, that's. I don't know. I I feel like Coach Rick, um, Coach Coach Mark Rick, is more like the headarchy of like our our offense and like the quarterback positions. Like he's very specific. And then you got Coach John Rick, which is he's a lot younger, so he's close to our age, so he can get more personal with us. So like I know like I've talked to him one on one just about yo like can you stay after practice and help me out with my footwork and he'll stay after and he'll help me. So like Coach Rick is more like structure, and then Coach John Rick is more like he can like he's more compatible with this because he's at he's at that younger age. So I mean, the way they're coaching it. it I, I feel like it bounces off perfectly. So. What do you what do you call them? Like Coach Rick, Coach Rick, yeah, or Coach John, I, kinda, Coach yeah, Mark? I, I call them both Coach Rick, and then like they, they kind of like look at you and be like, hey, "You Coach Rick," like John. <laughs> so it's kind of funny, yeah. But I mean, they they got used to it. But does when you talk about structure and Mark Rick, does he help you specifically, Malik? Yeah. So he's he's in our QB room, and like we go through every rep. We'll go through uh, seven on seven. We'll go through all the team periods, and what he, what what he's good at is is really honing in on our feet. And as I said earlier. Um, He's he's a very he's big on precision. Like he wants everything to be perfect, and he doesn't care if you get the ball out right. He doesn't care how you do it. He wants your feet to be perfect because your feet make you perfect. And so that's that's his biggest goal is get our feet right, and then everything else will take care of itself. How do you um, split reps? In um, we split reps. So like it goes by like rotation. So like uh, the first week it, it went me, Evan, Brad was with the ones it went me, Evan, uh, Vince, and Jack, and then like every day like we just rotate up. And then it, so I think it was uh, yeah today was Vince. Uh, Al, uh, Jack, me, then uh, Evan, and then it'll go up. It'll go Jack, me, um, Evan, then Vince. So it just goes up like that. And so Brad's we split always up. first. Yeah, so he's with the ones just to try to get like them comfortable with Brad because the offense is a little different than last year. Um, we're under center, which I mean, I personally I like it. I like to have that like physical mentality, and so does Coach Rick. And so I mean, it's a good feeling being out here and being physical. How, how much is yeah, how much is Coach Rick's uh, you know resume having coached two Heisman winners and? You know, great quarterbacks he's had under so how much does that make you guys respect and kind of really respond to what he's giving you guys I mean I mean yeah like um, his resume is it, it speaks loudly uh, I know me and Brad kind of get frustrated because we're out here making mistakes and you go in the film room and we'll watch Aaron Murray and we'll watch uh, Hudson Mason and we'll watch them do it perfectly with their rhythm drops and their three with a spin like all this stuff and me and Brad like why can't we do it like them and and one thing like Coach John talked to me about, he was like, when you watch them and like with, with the colleagues that they're showing us, that them, that's them doing it perfect. You're not watching them making mistakes. And so Coach John Rick has been really encouraging on us, just keep grinding, keep working, and that we're gonna get it right. And then he's actually gonna make like a uh, funny cut up tape of us, like doing it wrong in the spring and then in the summer and fall, how, how much better have we have progressed in through, through this offense. So is it kind of like a good cop, bad cop between kind, the guys? Not really bad cop. I mean, <laughs> Coach, Coach Rick, he gave me a, uh, Coach Martin gave me a great compliment. He uh, There was a play like I scrambled and he told me good job. He was like way to extend the play so I mean like they're both like they complement each other like I feel like coach Mark Rick really looks for like the structure and then coach John Rick Moore is trying to like get on the same level with trying to find chemistry and trying to like just just get to know us and so it's a great feeling. What do you think about what the basketball team's been doing? <laughs> the basketball team oh man they were playing unreal um we're hoping that they that they just keep going I mean um a lot of the guys like me and David are cool with a lot of guys on the basketball team so we give them our support uh Jaquan's a great player I mean a lot of the guys are great great players I know uh I mean I don't know. I mean, I, I think they can go all the way. I mean, I, I like Angel. I like Angel's shot. I like the way he passes it. I like the way he, he distributes the ball. But, I mean, I think they got a chance. Thank you. All right, no problem.